The first step to holding a note is being able to hold it as long as possible. The way that you do that, you have to breathe. Now, most people breathe, they think they have to breathe like this. But that's not good enough. What you have to do is you have to breathe how? Through your diaphragm. Through your diaphragm. You have to breathe, filling your, your belly up with air and releasing it very, 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 very slowly. It allows you to fill yourself with, up with enough air to hold it long enough to put out the note, okay? Now that's the first key, breathing diaphragmatically. So we're gonna do this again. Sit up straight, okay? Hand on your stomach, all right? And breathe. There you go. Fill it up and breathe it out. There you go. It allows you to do, to release more air, okay? All right, that's the first step, all right? So make sure you definitely getting your breath right. Don't pass out, because I've, I've seen that happen too. But, um, so, um, Let's start with, um, with uh, another breathing exercise. We're going to fill it up and so now what Ashlyn was doing is she was breathing, but what she did is she actually let out too much air in the beginning. You know what I mean? So fill it up again, all right? So what that allows is this. See, I just did the same notes, and I just gave it just a little, you know, that's a, a background key. When you want to do backgrounds, you can actually add that in there, you know what I mean? But the main focus is so that when you're holding your breath, I could keep going if I wanted to because I filled my diaphragm up with enough air, okay? Mm -hmm. But that's the key. Finding that breathing technique that's going to help you be able to hold your notes, okay? That's first.